Pension reform plan has been a hot topic for months, and tonight we're taking a closer look at what it all means. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly continues our in-depth coverage tonight at the State House with the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Yes, state lawmakers are now off to the races. Rhode Island is now officially on the road to pension reform. Whether it flies or not, the pension reform wheels are now rolling here at the State House. Union leaders gathering and watching closely as what's been called the Day of Reckoning arrives at the State House. A special session to deal with pension reform legislation. Governor Lincoln Chafee wants to make three big changes that would save billions over time. The plan would eliminate cost of living adjustments known as COLAs possibly for as long as 15 years for state and municipal retirees. It would raise the retirement age to match the social security rules and it would create a hybrid plan that would mix pensions with 401k style retirement savings. So Immediately, the union that represents the largest group of state workers is fighting the idea. To induce workers to come to work, and then at the end of their careers tell them, oh no, that promise, that commitment, when we hired you, we're not gonna keep, is something we will not accept. Are you promising a court fight? I'm promising to do whatever I have to do to make certain that the commitment made to the employees I represent is kept. That sounds like a court fight to me. Well, if it has to be litigation to straighten it out, my hope would be that it isn't. Asked Michael Donnie whether he expects the pension reform fight to get ugly. He said he prefers the word relentless. Buckle up. Here we go. Live at the Statehouse with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.